Hey guys, Noah here. Today we're going to be unboxing the Nintendo Switch OLED in the white color. Let's begin. Last time I unboxed the Switch was the, uh, I believe in 2018, the red and blue original. Not the V2 with the uh, better battery. So we're going to begin with this. So I can't even really use it because I have my old Switch, um, which I can actually take out. Um, let me get that for you guys and I'll show you on camera. Um, but yeah, I'm going to buy a big SD card, probably a 512 gig, just to, uh, put it in there. So, I still have my original Switch here. And it turns on, which is great, as you guys can see. Um, so yeah. This one's the white Joy-Con. Looking nice. Looking good. Let me take that out of the sleeve. I actually got a huge discount on this. So not too shabby. I'm going to put it on the switch itself. Looks great. Here we go, we got the tablet. I'm gonna try not to touch the screen at all. Just because, now I don't know if it's gonna turn on, I don't know if it's dead, but feels nice. See if it turns on. Oh, I guess it does. Nice. Now the thing I love about the OLED screens is that they're pure black. So if you have like a black screen, It'll look like the thing's actually off, so I'm going to lower the, lower that. Now it wants you to dock the Joy-Cons here. And then we'll do the other one. I got the white color just because it was something different. Um, yeah, here we go. It looks so much better. English. I'm going to do all the account stuff later, probably. Let me... I'm going to set it up later. I'm going to do it later. Um, put our time in here. Was it the... F New York. It's December... What, 9th? I think. 10th? 9th. Oh, did it just hit midnight? I think it just did. It's 1 a.m. and 5 seconds. Something like that. Detach. Okay. Wants me to detach it now. And you can set it down there. So next. Okay. Next. You can import from another console. I'm going to transfer it. Uh, I'll probably do it later. I mean... I'll just select, I don't know, I guess Luigi. Maybe I'll just import it. Oh, there's a more options. I know it's a terrible angle, but I'm going to dock the... I'll just do the, uh, Mario here. I'm going to do a red background here. Do my name. Longer unboxing than I thought it was going to be. Okay. Later. Skip. Skip. Yup. 
put on the dark mode. Um, lower the brightness to about like that. That looks fine. So you do get like 64, but it's like 55. Um, themes, black. But. Yeah. Um, pretty simple. It's just a switch. I mean, you get, you know, double the storage. You get better kickstand. You get uh, better speakers and stuff. So I can't wait to play some new games on this, like the, Cur the Kirby Forgotten Land or uh, Mario Wonder, Super Mario Bros. Wonder. So, yeah. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hey guys, Noe here, uh, post editing Noe here, and I forgot to actually unbox the rest of the box here. Uh, I was too busy focused on setting up the switch on the software side, so let's actually look at the hardware of the box. So you actually do get some decent stuff in here. You do get an HDMI cable, pretty cool, because you need that obviously to connect to the TV. You do get a power brick, and I'll take that out, because I do need to start charging this and it's good that i got a new switch because i did have mine for probably four or five years and i assume the battery has degraded to some degree um get your standard USB-C cable thank god for USB-C because it is honestly my favorite um you do get the grip normally like 10 bucks but do you get the little grip and then the HDMI cable, I will open, but I'll do that later. Because I don't feel like setting up the TV right now. That aspect. So, you also get two straps for... I think it's also slightly different with the design. You get two... Um, two, like, strap things for the Joy-Cons. You also get the dock, which is also improved. I forgot to highlight. Um, it has an Ethernet port. So, if you're playing Smash, that should also help. Take that out here. I do like the white color. I think it's a very nice addition. Um, looks cool. It's got some padding, I guess. I don't know. You got two USB ports right here. And on the back, you got a cable management. And you can route... Let's see... You can, uh, let's see, there we go. Got HDMI, AC, and your Ethernet, LAN as they call it. I call it Ethernet, I'm just used to that. So, yeah. Forgot, can't believe I forgot to show you guys the inside of the box. But, now that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have a great day. Have a good one.